Today we're going to be reviewing a big commerce website to improve their conversion rates and generate more leads. If you want to see all the reviews, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. All right, I'll be reviewing the dedicated marinesupplies.com website. Well, as soon as I arrived there, I immediately saw the slider that opened up and it said just now an authorized dealer, Lutron. People have no idea what you have to offer. And within those first two or three seconds, more than likely people are conf be confused on what you are selling. That picture of the boat in the second slide is probably the one you want to start with and start with a static slide. Do not rotate these slides. More than likely, no one's clicking on the third or fourth slide anyway. I would recommend starting with the actual picture of the boat and having a clear call to action, telling people exactly where to go. Right now, there's a lack of direction on what you want, actually want people to do. Also, majority of e-commerce sites have an 80-20 rule. You pay 80% of your revenue off of 20% of your inventory. So what you want to do is define that 20% and then list that order out here. Get people to buy things that they normally would buy. And then list them out. Have a section here, best sellers, and then list the, the top best sellers. And don't put very high ticket items on your homepage. Even though someone might be interested in buying a $450 light, you may not want to have that as your first item. And then have different se sections that you can segment out to get people to the right section, in the right place. Also at the very, very bottom, this opt-in area, no one wants to sign up for newsletters. People don't care about newsletters. People don't want to receive emails. People want to receive special offers and coupons. So I would say sign up for our special offers and coupons, enter your email, and then the button say sign up free. Also looks like you got some error right there. You're not bringing in your, your Facebook or something. Also your footer is just, it, ha it lacks personality and, and direction. It, th these don't necessarily look like links and it's hard to really find where you want people to do. Majority of the time in the footer, people go down and they're going to click on the about us and contact because you're offering a lot of different items that, you know, if I'm not in to, you know, if I don't know what I'm looking for, how do I know that this thing is actually going to solve my problem? Majority of the time people will go up to the top and they'll search. This right here is too vague. You want to tell people exactly what to search for. Search for marine electronics and then right next to it have a large phone number that has a accompanying call to action. Speak with a marine electronics specialist. Call 954-767 because right now this is way too small. And this is actually the most important section on your whole page. And as soon as people do a little scroll, it goes away. If I were to actually add an item to a cart, let's say I actually click on this and I had uh, add to cart, there's looks like there's a lot of issues with this pop-up. You have things getting cut off here, so I highly recommend you fix this because right now it looks like the site is just completely not credible and I, I'm not sure what to do. I can't click away from this window. Um, only thing I can do is potentially click um, to check out. And let's say I actually close this and now I'm, I'm, I'm browsing around and I actually want to go and, and check out. How do I do it? I don't know how to do it because not many people know that they can click on this little link at the very, very top. There needs to be a big button next to it that says shopping cart or view cart or checkout, telling people exactly what to do. You do not want to make assumptions and guess that people know exactly what to do. But overall, every single page on your site needs a unique value proposition. Just because you say dedicated marine supplies, you want to tell people why you're special, why you should be doing business, they should be doing business with you. It should say the specialists in marine electronics delivered to you from Fort Lauderdale. We've been in business for X amount of time. You have to understand what people are looking for, what their intent is, and what their questions are before they arrive. With any e-commerce site, people want to know what the guarantees are, what the return policies are, what the shipping policies are, and what exactly are they going to, uh, how, how, how can you make them feel more confident about purchasing from you? Your navigation, also, big problem. People don't buy based on brands unless it's super you know, under, easy to understand. Right now you're limiting who you're marketing to. It looks like you're only marketing to marine engineers specifically. So what if I am a captain on a boat and I'm looking for a particular light? I have no idea what any of these things mean. You should be organizing your sections based on segment and need, not necessarily based on brand. 
So let's say I actually do click on this master vault. I arrive here. All of these look exactly the same to me. You're forcing me to go in and literally read all these little things in order to figure out you know, where to go. Okay, yes, I understand that you can, you can segment out on the left here by different vaults and different things, but it's very confusing to me. I, you're not telling me, you're not giving me enough information about what is actually going on here. The, and this looks like generic. Master Volt is the leading manufacturer of battery chargers, inverters, and marine, marine accessories. You want to make this personal. Tell people exactly why they, they need this and if they have any questions, to call. Speak with a marine electronics specialist. Call 1-800 or 954, whatever, whatever. Okay, let's, uh, also, you ha I noticed if I wanted to add to cart on some of your pages, this gets cut off. I, I can't even add to the, this uh, item to a cart from this, this checkout area if I really wanted to. Also, if they're not ready to, if, or they're not sure of what to buy when they actually click add to the cart, you should actually have a box here that says speak with a marine electronic specialist. Call 954-767, etc. Also, people are going to want to ensure that you're a credible source. You have a lack of credibility. There's no testimonials. And when I actually click on the About Us page, it says, based in sunny South Florida. How exciting. There's no credibility. I don't know who you are. I don't know if you're going to steal my information or what you're going to do with if I actually even give you my email address. So having a clear About Us page, adding testimonials, adding uh, ratings and reviews, you know, all of your, your categories should have little star symbols underneath it that uh, this particular item has been reviewed. Incentivize your customers to give you reviews. And we'll look at some uh, examples of that. Also, when I actually do go to the shopping cart, everything is like monochromatic and purple. Uh, you know, maybe, you know, purple is a, a color that you like, but it doesn't seem like this is a marine site. It doesn't seem like this is really marketing to me. And I'm really unsure of what to do. You know, because everything is black and gray and, and purple, okay but it doesn't really make sense to me. These almost look like, um, you know, buttons that I click on here, this click on here, what if I don't have a coupon code? Uh, th there's a lot of questions and, and issues that I have with, with the shopping cart process. Also, your shopping cart process needs to tell people specifically that they're, it's secure, that you have alternative payment pr plans, um, that they could potentially buy with, with PayPal if they, if they can. And also your buttons need to look like buttons. These particular buttons, they're, everything's, has uh, sharp corners you want to sure they have rounded corners and make the text not all capitalized capitalized text usually looks like headers and this doesn't look like a button when i actually do click on proceed to checkout same issue as a non-technical person it's very hard to understand that you're not going to steal my information how do i call is it secure what's the return policy is there a money back guarantee and you need to answer all of those questions if you're card abandonment rates are really high, it's because majority of people are clicking on either add to cart, something like this, add to cart, and then they're saying, okay, I'm not ready to do something right now, so they maybe they, cl they click away, and they go to another page, and they have no idea on how to get back to the cart because you're missing a clear view cart button. So let's take a look at a couple of examples. I just found this particular one. This is built on big commerce as well. You want to ensure that you're marketing to new visitors versus returning visitors. They do a great job of offering 10% for first time visitors who visit the site and then a coupon code. This will incentivize more people to purchase in a shorter period of time. Also, they are segmenting out their homepage based on people's needs, office chairs, uh, outdoor furniture, dining, bar and counter stools. This is a great way to get people to the right place of what they're looking for. Because majority of people probably don't know what they're looking for on your site based on all these different brands. You should be segmenting out your homepage based on what their need is, not necessarily what the, the particular brand or product that you're looking for. People buy products based on what their benefit and solutions are gonna be, not necessarily by what the, the brand is always. So they're doing a great job of this, having a clear phone number at the very, very top, and look, a clear shopping cart. Very good job on this site as well. As I click down 
Below, even more segments, popular categories, popular searches. Oh, look, this looks professional. Look at their footer compared to yours. Our newsletter compared to send me coupons and promotions for this. Join. I recommend that this would say something like join free or sign up free, but they're doing a good job of, of collecting email addresses here as well. Also having the secure symbols, you know, Norden, GeoTrust, but I also recommend adding Better Business Bureau and those type of symbols. Let's go ahead and click on their about page. Oh, look, this could easily be a picture of Fort Lauderdale or the, the CEO of your company on a boat. Getting people not to think is really the idea and then re-encouraging everything with authority and credibility. Right now, there's a, a nice little paragraph, particularly from the founders. It just creates a personality, it creates a real world effect and, and ensures people that you're not going to steal their information. Find anything for your modern home. You, you're not guessing that people know that they actually can search for, they're telling people exactly what to do with a clear button. And then they're segmenting out their, their, their navigation based on category, furniture, chandeliers, wall lights, bathrooms. This could easily be LED lights, uh, AC, re battery rechargers, whatever your top categories are, this is a great way to do it. I also recommend that they would put either a sales section or a clearance section to get people to those right areas. Let's take a look at another example. Another big commerce site. They have a slider, but look, as it rotates, it's easy to read. Find a wall decal today. M many people are not going to know what Cherry Walls is. So what they're doing is they're slowing down the slider and then putting the text exactly in, in, the, in the same spot every single time. And then also reinsuring it with free delivery. Free shipping is the number one promotion that you should have on all of your e-commerce sites. And look at how they, they organize their navigation. Specials, products, top sellers, tree decals, home decals, samples, how to do it. If you tell people about how to do something, how to fix a light, how to fix their boat, they're more likely maybe to do business with you in the long run, FAQs. And look, 100% guarantee. Having a guarantee is essential to ensuring that you, you get the people to buy as quick as possible. Also, a nice little rotating thing of examples of how people are using their, their inventory. This could easily be pictures of boats or people working on boats on how they're installing lights. And uh, I highly recommend you, you do something like this as well. Adding testimonials. The best way to get more people to buy your products is using testimonials. Social proof. People like to buy things that other people have bought. So having reinsurance through testimonials and authority is key. Also, you know, segmenting out based on how to's, telling people exactly how to install lights, how, how to, to fix your AC, and then having sections about that. Clear social media, nice looking footer, a little about us story, and uh, a little bit more social proof you may see us here. Let's take a look at some examples uh, in search. What you wanna do is go into search and look for the people who are actually doing paid ads. So pop up here, look, marine electrical results for this particular category they're refining their results based on brand price and rating this is a great way to filter through to get people to the right place navigation exterior lights circuit breakers marine bat batteries you know not the best looking sites but they are making it easy to understand how do you get to the right place at the right time receive the latest special offers and expert reviews Norton, Norton security symbol, clear search at the very, very top. Boat wiring store, marine electrical products. You know, not the best looking site, but they are organizing their site in the right way. You know, you can look at this picture and you can know that that's wire. You can look at this picture and you know it's some type of box. And they're segmenting out their categories and their products based on each individual section. Having a guarantee is essential to improving, you know, getting people to buy in a shorter period of time. 100% satisfaction guarantee. If you're not happy for any reason, you can return it. So maybe you, not, you, you give a certain amount of days to return your product, but definitely offering a guarantee is very, very important. Also, let's take a look at how this site, which is on BigCommerce, they organize their categories. 
Let's click on let's click on chandeliers. Look, as you arrive here, you can re or refine this section. Let's compare it to your category section. You can reorganize this category section based on their intent, the type, and p potentially materials. So have it, have, this is a great way to filter down through faceted search. Also, look, they have a clear clear price along with money that you uh, you can save along with little stars. Having those little stars ensure people to make them feel comfortable about about purchasing. If you only have a limited stock, showing three three left is a great way to actually get people to buy in a shorter period of time as well. As I click here and I and I arrive at the page, let's take a look at your your page versus this one. Oh look, on the left hand side here, there's a shop with confidence box. Free shipping, 110% price match guarantee. Free returns and zero sales tax. These are this is the exact same technology here, but look, the one on the right, it's clear. Clearly looks like a button with a little bit of rounded corners. Free shipping, no sales tax. Call for our best prices. Putting the phone number right underneath the add to cart button is a great way to get people to to buy. Having a another shop with confidence box, free shipping, no restocking fees, price match guarantee. Our pledge to you: the more you can make people feel about actually purchasing, the more likely you're going to get conversions in the long run. Also, let's take a look at as I actually check out. Oh look, looking at this page versus that one. The shopping carts are exactly the same, but look, this actually looks like a real shopping cart. It looks like I, I can actually click on this button. It's easy to understand. The it, the visual elements are are clear, and I know exactly what to do. On the left, it just doesn't look. It looks unfinished. Gray on top of gray, it just doesn't look like a completed site. Let's go ahead and click on proceed to checkout, and proceed to checkout. Again, the exact same technology, but look, they're organizing through an order, order summary section, a need help section, and having a clear phone number. A lot of people are not going to be interested on spending $300 with your company if, if, you, if they have a hard time finding out how to actually contact you. So this is a great way to really uh, you know, show people exactly how to purchase. A lot of, lot of things you can do, but in summary, I highly recommend you, you know, make the, the search clear, have a clear phone number at the very, very top, and use ways to segment out your homepage to get people to find the right solution. Ready to increase your revenue and generate more leads? Visit alexdesigns.com for your custom conversion rate optimization plan.